Brody's test. Okay. Brody's reagent is reagent is to come off for DNP. To come off for DNP, to come off for dinitrophenyl hydrazine, C double bond O, H2N, NH, phenyl group on heating, plus of water molecule takes place, C double bond N. NH nitro group here is also what nitro group and O2 here is also what and O2 this is yellow color precipitate therefore use it to use it to identify use it to identify of identify of which one carbonyl compounds this is a general test of carbonyl compounds. It is a general distinguished test of which one? Carbonyl compounds. Now, due to presence of electron withdrawing group, the adjacent carbon is alpha carbon. Some of the reactions which are related to alpha hydrogen containing reactions. So such reactions are known as aldol condensation. Which condensation? Aldol condensation. First one, aldol condensation. Aldol condensation. Generally, alpha hydrogen containing carbonyl compounds reacts with dilute bases or aqueous bases to form beta hydroxy carbonyl compounds. This particular product is known as aldol product when alpha hydrogen containing carbonyl compounds reacts with bases to form beta hydroxy carbonyl compounds this reaction is known as aldol condensation to undergo aldol condensation at least one alpha hydrogen is required on alpha carbon at least one alpha hydrogen is required on alpha carbon. Now, CS3, C double bond OH, this is known as estaldehyde. Estaldehyde react with same mole of estaldehyde in presence of aqueous sodium hydroxide aqueous sodium hydroxide to form beta hydroxy 
बीटा हाइड्रोक्सी बुटेरॉल डी हाइड दिस इज द फंक्शनल ग्रुप द एजिसेंट कार्बन इज अल्फा द नेक्स्ट कार्बन इज बीटा सो देर फोर दिस इज नोन एज बीटा हाइड्रोक्सी beta hydroxy butyrol dehyde this product is known as aldol product aldol product if you want the formation of this particular product first we go for the mechanism how aldol product is formed mechanism is an important uh, new reaction it is an important new reaction mechanism c double bond o h this is a functional group carbon it can act as a electron withdrawing group every electron withdrawing group adjacent to carbon is known as alpha carbon because c double bond o group oxygen is more electronegative than carbon so therefore oxygen withdraw the electrons from carbon carbon is deficient this carbon would withdraw the electrons from carbon this adjacent to carbon so that is the reason why this group can act as electron withdrawing group so in organic chemistry electron withdrawing group adjacent to carbon is known as alpha carbon so this alpha carbon contains any hydrogens known as alpha hydrogens these hydrogens are acidic in nature so that is the reason why these are easily react with bases these are easily react with bases this bond shifted here now it converts into ch2 minus c double bond o adjacent it is known as carbon anion carbon carries which charge negative charge so therefore it is known as carbon anion carbon anion of acetaldehyde now after formation of this carbon anion is stabilized by resonance because this negative charge and this double bond both are conjugated to each other so therefore which is possible resonance is possible to form a stable enolate ion this is known as enolate ion in this enolate ion the more electronegative oxygen carries which charge negative charge so that is the reason why it is stable so in order to get stability in order to get stability alpha hydrogen is liberated from alpha carbon to form a carbon anion this carbon anion converts into its enolate ion this is the first step in the second step after formation of a carbon anion this carbon anion again combined with another mole of acetaldehyde another mole of acetaldehyde that is the reason why initially we are taken how many moles of acetaldehyde two moles of acetaldehyde now ch3 c double bond oh plus CH2 minus C double bond OH then this carbon anion will attack the another mole another mole of acetaldehyde okay here is what loss of water molecule then O minus CH CH2 
already here. Now, when water molecule is added to this, H plus comes here. When H plus added to this, when H plus added to this, CHOH then CH2 C double bond O H this is known as aldol product aldol product this is the mechanism of the formation of aldol product 